Hi, good morning. Welcome to the sports segment here on the AM Show. My name is Benedict Tuusu. And of course, uh, this morning, Kumasi Asante Kotoko is trending following a statement that uh, the uh, Minshia Palace, that's uh, the owner of the club life patron, Otun Force to uh, released yesterday with regards to everything that has been going on at the club. One, it talks about uh, the transfer saga uh, between Asante Kotoko and Esperance, which has resulted to a possible FIFA ban if they should fail to pay an amount of 240 there's more in the following report. The Porcupine Warriors are facing a transfer ban internationally and locally after a $240,000 fine was imposed on them by the World Football Governing Body. The fine is as a result of the illegal signing of Esperance striker Emmanuel Clote in 2015. The club has until May 17 to settle the debt or will be banned from registering new players. Esperance reported Kotoko to FIFA after the Ghanaian giant had demanded the payment of the summer fee of midfielder Kwame Bonsu. Kotoko transferred Bonsu to Esperance for a reported $150,000 in July 2019. A part of the statement released by Mansha on Wednesday read, and I quote, a committee has been appointed to investigate all the circumstances surrounding Asante Kotoko Sporting Club transactions with Tunisian club Esperance, which resulted in the FIFA ruling and the subsequent transfer of another Asante Kotoko player to the club. Unquote. Also, the statement revealed Executive Chairman Dr. Kwame has submitted a report of his stewardship for the past three years to the palace. So that was uh, as I read our coach report. We still stay with Kumasi Asante Kotoko and telecommunications giant MTN has suspended all financial obligations uh, to the club. Well, Nana Kwame, Nana Jim Bibi, who is general manager of the club, has been speaking about this. Uh, the contract we have with MTN, it is stated categorically in the contract that anytime there's a there's a closure led by a force ma a force measure, it means the contract can either be terminated or it can be it can be suspended. As today, as I speak with you, there's been a letter from MTN to Masters and Tikotoko claiming they are suspending all their financial obligations to the club. Well, as I speak with you, and this is in conformity of the clause in the contract that allows them to do so. So um, it means that there will be there will be there will be difficulty in terms of the club's financial situation. Yeah. And coupled with the absence of football, and once there is no football, it means the club is not making any any uh, money or revenue, which obviously makes it very difficult to take care of the, um, the club's financial obligations to whoever the club is in contract with. So these and many other reasons are why. We have uh, been engaging the, the employees of the club, uh, especially the playing body, to accept the pay cut so that the club can be taken care of in these hard times and the club can also be sustained in this difficult situation, in these difficult times.